यार ठंड में But you have to wake up because life goes on. So yeah, I just got up and did my normal everyday routine. You know, sometimes this exam season turns so hectic, but I don't really like to throw all my routine just for the exams. I feel it's important to take care of yourself, your mind during exams because you should stay calm during exams. I don't like staying up all night just one day before to study everything. I will try to cover things few days before the exam taki mujhe ek raat pehle utni dikkat na ho. So yes, I try to refresh myself every morning spending time with me and just you know enjoying the moment and just feeling the life. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. There must be something that feeds her. Okay, so I'm done with my morning routine and my profs are from 20th Jan, first professional MBBS, and I'm not scared except in biochem because I still don't know how I'll figure that out. But we'll see in the coming days. So right now I'm going to study physiology. I'll revise CNS and special senses because I think those two chapters are the most conceptual and very big. So yeah, I'm going to do that. And also I'm trying out a new technique to study. You know, मतलब uh, if you aren't prepared that much and you want to prepare 20, 30 days before the exam, I'm trying it out. But I'll be able to let you know the consequences only after I give my profs if it helped me or not. So I'll let you know after my profs what technique I was trying, but Yeah, I think it's going really good. I really like it. Let's get started with the day. watching lectures of anatomy because if you don't revise anatomy regularly you'll just fall out of it i started watching neuroanatomy and special senses clinical points because i find it very tough to solve those clinical questions from these and in our prof it's a very high chance that any clinical case will come so yeah i started doing it After lectures I started solving this question bank next edition which has clinical scenario based questions to test my clinical knowledge it has active guidance highlights that give hint about the answer now you can know which are the points hidden in the question that lead you to the answer explanation of all the options on why that particular option is correct or incorrect in case you have a doubt in an option why you thought it was correct but it wasn't and my very favorite learning objective brief summary of the topic you don't have to pick up the book you can revise all the important points that are needed to be remembered from here treasures flash cards that help in quick revision and memory retention video link related to the concept of the questions also given you can go and watch the lecture all over again to get the understanding prep ladder is given free 10 days trial for this question bank if you want to try it you can go down in my description box and click on the link and you can try it for yourself too So I just finished around 12 to 13 question and I guess in total there are around 30 questions. So yeah because I don't want to you know um, make myself monotonous right now because I want to have maximum productivity throughout the day. So what I'm going to do is right now that I've studied 12 questions there are a lot of information in my head. Now I'm going to write uh, you know the question and answers of the another chapter. तो मैं आज उसके क्वेश्चन आंसर ऑलमोस्ट कंप्लीट कर लूँगी ताकि मैं कल उसको इसी के साथ वापस से रिवाइज कर पाऊँ सो एवरी डे आई एम डूइंग लाइक दिस आई एम डूइंग फ्यू चैप्टर्स एंड देन आई एम रिवाइजिंग इट डे बाई डे सो आई स्टार्टेड राइटिंग द क्वेश्चन ऑफ फिजियोलॉजी एंड इन मेडिकल कॉलेजेस इट इज़ वेरी डिफरेंट फ्रॉम नीट यू हैव अ स्पेसिफिक वी आई पी लिस्ट दैट इज़ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक लिस्ट एंड इट्स एक्चुअली द 
you know summation of questions that are important for your university exams is that first professional so i write all the questions at one place and before the exams i revise that it actually covers everything that is important and study of mbbs is very different the syllabus is so 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 vast that you just can't retain everything so these vip topics list questions are so important that it will actually feel like a life savior to you and i can't stress on this fact enough when you will come into medical college you will actually feel that So I wrote all the questions and here I wanted to share there are a few aphasias is that you know abnormalities of speech and it's actually so you know interesting like a person will talk fluently but with no meaning of the words he might talk non fluently but with some meaning and things like that i mean it actually gives a feel of real mbbs sometimes किलो कैलरी पर मीटर स्क्वायर पर आर यूनिट यूनिट याद रखना ठीक है फैक्टर्स अफेक्टिंग बी एम आर में थायरॉयड हार्मोन में थायरॉयड बढ़ता है तो बी बढ़ता है और ये एक सिग्निफिकेंस है कि तुम्हारा थायरॉयडिज्म को डिटेक्ट करने के लिए भी यूज़ किया जा सकता है बी की वैल्यू फीवर में वन डिग्री सेल्सियस अगर बढ़ता है तो इंक्रीज इन बी एम आर बाई टू ट्वेल्व और एक्सरसाइज में एक्सरसाइज में ऑब्वियसली कार्डिया आउटपुट बढ़ रहा है तो बी एम आर बढ़ेगा काफी अच्छे से पढ़ाई किया and chili garlic noodles and that was it for the day i felt totally satisfied with all the work that i had done i didn't eat mess food which was saddening for me because i'm trying to develop this habit of eating less bahar ka khana but sometimes it's just unavoidable and in thand when you crave that chatpata hot food it's totally unavoidable and then it was it i'll see you in the next video